Hey guys, what's up? My name is Fresh AJ and I bring you guys a squad builder and man, uh, this squad is amazing. You know, um, I was getting bored with Ultimate Team so I decided to build another squad and I came up with this squad and it is so good. I ended up winning Division 1 with the first try and I mean with a bit of help with my German side giving the squad some rest but overall it is pretty beastly and if you guys are from random FIFA videos, well hi. My name is Fresh AJ, I'm 18, I'm from America, I'm black, and I love long walks on the beach. Yeah, this is getting awkward, but anyways, first off in goal, we're going to be using Renee Adler, and he's actually pretty good. Uh, 87 diving, 86 reflexes, 81 handling, and 83 positioning. He cost me 3,000 coins, and that's a pretty good price for him. I mean, this guy was doing beast performances you know he had did like a double save for me before and it was actually kind of shocking how he saved him but overall this guy is pretty good I mean he is a huge upgrade from his normal card and for whatever reason his upgraded card is better than his first informed card but you know I'm, I'm not going to complain overall I mean for 3,000 coins he is definitely worth the price but now our center backs are going to be Jeru our center center back is going to be Jerome Boateng, and our final center back is going to be Mangala. Now, Jeru, he's actually pretty good. I never used him before, and I decided to try him out. He, you know, because he has decent defending stats. You know, 75 pace, 76 defending, 77 heading. He's actually and he's 642. So, um, when the quarters come, if he's in a good position, he will definitely make those. Although I didn't score score them with him, and that's because somebody else was always getting the uh, corners but we're gonna go into that later um our next center back jerome boateng everybody knows about this guy 75 pace 77 defending and 81 heading this guy he is just a brick wall people i mean six four good for those corners for what he has four star weak foot and lord knows why i mean he's not gonna be up the pitch but you know no complaints here three star skill moves is also a plus with him and this guy's overall a pretty good center back and i would recommend you guys try him if you haven't already tried him and our final center back is going to be mangala 79 pace 77 defending and 80 heading people already already know about him i never used him before i wanted to try him out before and this guy's pretty beast i wanted to get his team in a season card but as you can see at the top right i didn't have enough coins after i built this squad and his normal card is actually pretty good anyway so i didn't feel the need to fork up the extra 100,000 coins even if i did have it but this guy's overall good center back and i i would recommend you guys try him now our center mids are going to be bark freddy i think I think that's how you pronounce his name and we're going to be using also in villa now this guy is mainly here for chemistry reasons for our left mid and i mean i mean there's nothing too special about this guy 65 pace 73 dribbling 72 uh defending i mean he's just here for um he's just here for chemistry purposes nothing more but overall you know he's pretty he's a pretty decent player he did the job i can't complain and now we're going to be using uh, M Villa for our other CDM, and he has 77 pace, 77 passing, 75 dribbling, and 81 defending. And this guy, he's just like another center back for me. He's overall a pretty good player. I mean, because his defending stats are actually really high for a CDM, so he's just perfect for sitting back there. And he, um, he, he for me, he slows down the attackers, and if he can't, um. If he can't slow them down enough, then, you know, the center backs would definitely take care of that. He's overall a pretty BCDM. And this is his pre chess card. He plays for some team in the Russian League. I can't think of it in my mind right now. But now our left mid is going to be Elia. And this guy is OP. I mean, everybody knows about him. 91 pace, 85 dribbling, 68 shooting, which is a lie, by the way. Um, 70 passing, and he, he's just a beast. I did not know that he had five-star skill moves and until uh, I decided to use him in the squad and I was just like man this is just getting better and better I think I have like three five-star skillers in the squad and he is overall a pretty good player I mean he only scored two goals for me but I'm still gonna play around with this team some more and I mean the strikers they were just hogging up all the goals which is pretty much why he doesn't have as many goals as he could and our right mid now is going to be Ben Afra. Everybody knows about this guy. I mean, five-star skiller, four-star weak foot, 83 pace, 75 shooting, 76 passing, 86 dribbling. I've never tried him before, and I wanted to try him in this squad, and I think he actually really fits. You know, he scored a goal for me, and he actually had a couple opportunities to score, but he, he was shooting on his right foot 
when I cut in with him for whatever reason. But overall, this guy is a good player. I mean, the five star skills is definitely a plus. His right foot definitely isn't, I mean, it's not useless because he has four star weak foot. It's just when I was trying to shoot with his right foot, I mean, the goalie was able to stop it because I cut in. But overall, this guy is actually a really beast player. Now our center attacking mid is going to be Grenier and I was actually really excited to try this guy. 74 pace, 76 shooting, 84 passing and 80 dribbling, 3 star skills and weak foot. And his normal card is actually a silver and this is his second in form and it got upgraded to a gold. And that's why I was mainly excited to try it. And his end game stats are ridiculous. I think he has like 90 free kick actually. Yeah. Um, 90 long shots or 92 long shots somewhere up there this guy is overall good shooting he didn't score any goals for me but it's because of the strikers but he is overall a pretty good player you know a solid center attacking midfielder in my opinion now our first striker is going to be Obama Yang not Martins let me swap him with the club again it's going to be Obama Yang and 93 pace, 79 dribbling, 75 shooting, 76 heading. I mean, what more can I say about this guy? Just beast. I mean, pace is king on FIFA, but his 75 shooting is definitely a lie. I mean, his finishing is unbelievable. His 79 dribbling is also a lie because in one of the clips, you'll see that this guy was just dribbling through the defenders and he scored a nice beautiful goal for me overall pretty solid uh, player and I think he might go for a K so if you're building a French squad definitely pick him up because he is worth it and finally the main man of this squad the reason I named the squad Ibrahimovic my second favorite footballer Ibrahimovic I mean what else can I say about him 77 pace 88 shot 79 passing 87 dribbling and 78 headers this guy is 6'5 with a black belt in taekwondo you do not want to mess with him on the pitch four star week for five star skill moves 13 goals in six games simply amazing I love this player I mean I've been waiting to finally use him on ultimate team and his price dropped and I picked him up. I mean, his price was a lot lower like a couple of weeks ago. I think it was going for 350k and I was expecting him to keep going down but he went back up but I didn't care because I wanted to use him and Ibra is such a monster and a tank on this game and you guys should definitely try him out if you have the coinage and I'm hoping he drops onto 300k because I would definitely keep him in my club if he does that. But anyways guys, this is the squad. I hope you guys enjoyed the squad build. Let me know anything that you would do to make it differently. And this is fresh. Let me know anything that um I can do to make these squad builders better and more entertaining for you guys. And I hope you guys enjoy the goals. I'm out.